Hello, my name is Crystal and I just thought I'd go through the Hello Best for Weddings magazine 31st of August 2015 which cost £2 and my mum get, kindly gave me a copy of this yesterday it's got Ronan Keating Mary Storm Eucrit I don't know if I've just pronounced that right but never mind what I notice about magazines and especially for teenage girls growing up and some of us very um, unfortunate females that haven't got perfect faces and flawless skin that you don't see anyone with a crooked tooth anywhere in this magazine or a chipped tooth or a blemish or a mole on their face or even a moustache you, know, you know some females have got hair on their faces us real people have blemishes we have marks we have cellulite and as you flip through the magazine, long hair, long luscious hair. And when I've used Pantene, it's never made my hair look like that either. Um, we are conned a lot of the time through false advertising as well. There we are again. Lovely smiling face with lovely luscious white teeth. Advertising products. Now a real woman doesn't look like that a real woman that buys products from the supermarket is maybe slightly overweight she's got cellulite her hair is not as long as that it's not lusciously locked her teeth haven't been um, what can we say whitened um, had a makeover because when you reach 46 plus over the years, your teeth chip through sweets, jaw breakers, um, they stain through tea bags. We are not being given a real image to give to children and teenagers as they grow up. And girls feel very, very um, inferior to the models in these magazines, but we shouldn't. This is not real. Um, famous people my, uh, my wedding was a registry office I didn't have a beautiful white dress these people are rich um, the common person on the street is not rich there are more homeless now than there ever was and I still see it in Chatham people begging outside McDonald's and these people they're so rich they have six or seven cars loads of houses and there are people living in substandard accommodation that people forget about and nobody cares about. Um, I'm trying to campaign to stop this kind of thing because it makes girls ill, it makes girls in anorexic, it makes girls hang themselves, it makes girls cry. I want to see women going out in the street unafraid to walk down the high street because we're given images like this. Every image in this magazine is either airbrushed, it's got superstars posing, not their natural selves, and basically I don't like it. Um, I don't buy magazines and you won't find me really buying a newspaper because they depress me and I don't want to feel depressed.